All right, so this video is gonna be about me wanting a blue wig. I'm really wanting a blue wig. But I didn't know how blue was gonna look on me and so I didn't wanna go spend money on a more high-end blue wig with like Renee of Paris and spend that money. Like I love Cheyenne, the blunt cut of mine. Um, I have that reviewed on my channel, I'll link it up here. And they offer that in a melted ocean color, but I just didn't want to spend money, um, a, more money on a high-end wig. So I decided to order some wigs that are cheaper price points and see how I like them. So this one I have put on, I have posted a picture on my Instagram, boom, right here, of when I got it, I pretty much posted a picture, no makeup, no nothing. And then I just got two in today that I have not even opened. So this is gonna be a video on blue wigs. All right, so this first one is from Amazon, like I said before, Lace Front Swiss Lace Bobby Boss Wig. This is Style Tiara MLF382, and this is in color TT1B Seaweed. And as you can see, this color like goes from like a green to a blue with a dark root. That's like a black root. The one B is the black root. So a couple things that I noticed right away that I'm not going to probably do in this video is you can pluck this hairline. I'm not going to do it today. I've already cut this lace in the front. Oh, that reminds me I'm going to need to get my pinking shears for those other two. And you can use concealer or powder in here. So today I will just use concealer and not pluck the hairline. So I've had a Bobby Boss wig before. I have actually didn't film a review for her. I got it to basically lay around the house and, and I love her. She's been really durable actually. Uh, she was like $30, $35. This one was, I think 35. And so I decided to go ahead and try um, a blue wig. So I can see through and I can see the teal, the green, the teal, and then the blue tips. Let me go ahead and show you inside the cap. The Bobby Boss has two hair combs right there, and that's gonna be like kind of right in here. And then it has one in the back of the nape. The napes on these are a little different. There really isn't a nape, it's like a lace nape here. So you can glue or tape down. I've never taped my Bobby Boss wigs because I've always just wore around the house. But I think with this one, I will practice using the tape and taping or gluing this down. I usually just do tape, not glue. Um, so I will definitely be playing around with that. This is an open lace nape with a comb there. I really like having the combs um, in these wigs because it kind of goes underneath my wig grip and just gives me an extra um, protection. Now I'm a little nervous because I'm wearing my lace wig grip, so I need to be careful and gentle with these combs when I put this on. So I'm just slipping that comb underneath my wig grip. So I have it even, okay? As you can see, one side is longer than the other. So that could be the style. I'm gonna go ahead and put some makeup in this part and try to see what I'm doing. are gonna have knots up there and see this lace right here this doesn't really blend into my skin so you just need some powder or 
concealer there. Or you just don't show it. Like I said, plucking this hairline would make it better. Let's brighten up the light. You can also do the part when it's not on your head and that would probably look a little bit better. But it looks better already just having that part in there, right? Like I said, plucking would make that, plucking that hairline would make it a lot better too. Let me go ahead and give you guys a spin. So I'm gonna ask you, what do you think of this wig? Do you think it's a great find for $35? Would you wear it? Let me know what you think about this Bobby Boss TR wig. This one is heat friendly, so you can style it. Like I said, it is showing short longer on one side. I don't know if that's because the curl pattern, it doesn't look like that in the picture on the model. So um, kind of hard to base it off that. All right, let's go to the next blue wig. These next two blue wigs are from the Janet collection and this collection is called the Color Me collection. So these are the same wig, same style, just different colors. This is in the chic wig. The chic wig has a six inch deep part lace wig for like a more natural look. Um, it will require probably plucking as well as some powder as well to make that wig look a little natural. I am gonna have to cut these so I have my pinking shears out. As you can see, there is lace in the front there. This collection comes in these colors. Look at those vibrant colors, so fun. So I just couldn't decide which blue I wanted, so I ordered both. I got these on elevatestyles.com, which uh, one of my wig sisters, Kim, sent me the link because she ordered one and I was like, oh my gosh, I'm getting those because I had posted about my other one and looking for blue wigs. So I thought, hey, I'll get these too. So I just couldn't decide, so I ordered both. There is a difference to both as you can see and there's a difference in the um, roots as well. So we're going to dive into these and get them going. I think first we will start out with the green blue color. So the chic wig is a roughly 14 inch in length, just blunt cut bob. Kind of curls underneath a little bit. So let's put her on and see how she fits. I still have the tags on. Um, let's actually go ahead and show her part. So I want to show you the lace front there. So I'm going to want to put some makeup there and I actually might go ahead and apply that now. So she has the two frontal combs, the part, which is right in the center part. She has the comb in the back of the weft and her ear taps are the same as the Bobby Boss. They're a lace tape, a lace ear tab where you can glue or tape down. You could also pluck this hairline, but for today I'm not going to do that. And I'm going to do some foundation on the part. You could also do this with concealer as well. I'm gonna really wanna pluck this really, but for today we'll do it like this. Okay, let's go ahead and put this on. I could wear my lace front wig grip in the middle with this one. I'll just have to play around with it with the combs. I just don't want it messing with the lace on the Milano lace wig grip. Okay, so one flaw I just found is that this ear, the strap, I went to put it in and it looks like the stitching overlapped the hole there. So I can't get it through the first or second loop. I have to go to the third loop. Um, so, you know, those are, this is a more affordable wig. And so that could be, you know, the reason why there's not usually the quality control that you would have with your high-end wigs. Okay, let's go ahead and put this on. Ah, oh, I love it. It actually feels good tightened anyway. Feels like it ain't going nowhere. 
I wonder if I could wear this to Disneyland. I feel like the girl from Descendants. I have kids. What do you guys think about this blue, this green blue color? Let me know in the comments which is your favorite so far. So we have the Bobby Boss Seaweed. We have the uh, Janet Collection. This is the green blue color. All right. So here is the other color in the Chic Wig by Jana Collection. This is in the color Blue Mist. I was actually really nervous about the roots on this because it starts with a light root rather than a dark root, but I actually like it. Um, I already put makeup in there. Um, you can pluck it as well. But this is a really fun blue. Now I really feel like Evie from Descendants. I'm a mom, so yes, I've seen all three of the Descendant movies from Disney <laughs> Channel. Anyway, so this reminds me a lot of that and actually a little bit more vibrant blue of what I'm looking for. So I'm really enjoying it. It's a cute color and this wig feels really good. It's Heat friendly. There are some things. It's shedding a lot. This one, the extenders fit good, so it was just that other one where the stitch was over it, so I couldn't go over it. But I actually tightened this one up because I just wanted to, you know, get a feel for it again. Fun blue, fun color. This, like I said, these are all affordable wigs. The first one I paid thirty-five for on Amazon, and then these last two are the Janet collections, and I got them on. Elevate style high fashion wigs that you'd find on Amazon. These are available on Amazon as well And I really like it. So what is your favorite out of all three? Is it the seaweed by Bobby Boss? Is it the green blue by Janet Collection? Or is it blue mist by Janet Collection? So I want to know your favorites, put down below. And I don't know, I like them all. I, I do seriously think that the Janet Collection hit it on spot for the color that I was looking for. I think the Bobby Boss Seaweed is just too dark. It was really hard to see in the light, even with my light ring on all the way up, where these Janet Collections are very vibrant. So maybe the Seaweed would be more natural blending and look the Janet Collection would be very bold in your face color. But anyway, let me know what your favorite was. If you haven't yet subscribed to my channel, please consider subscribing down below. Click the uh, bell notifications if you'd like to be notified when I post a new video. Give this video a thumbs up. Thank you so much. Don't forget to shine bright, love others, and be kind. I'll see you next time. Bye.